All right, here's a walkthrough on the 2020 Sunset Trail 289QB. So we're gonna start up in the front here. Power tongue jack makes it nice and easy to get on and off the truck. Two 20 pound LP tanks, and then your battery and box there. Pan out here, so this is gonna be your large storage compartment. Now on the other side, you can see that there is a rail that pulls out, makes it nice and easy to get to stuff. Your docking station here, so you got your city water connection, your black tank flush, water fill, and then a battery disconnect. It's nice because you can run a hose right up through there, so you don't have to have the compartment doors, you don't have hoses sticking out the side of your camper. Show you your slide out, you are on a cable system here. All the windows, seals look great and everything like that on those. Two windows back here for your bunks and then your water heater. Spare tire on the back and then there is an accessory hitch so if you wanted to put a bike rack or something like that you could. You do have a roof ladder with the pre-wiring for a Furion backup camera. Making our way to the campsite here so in the back you've got an outside kitchen so nice big black stone. Nice prepping space. This whole piece here pushes in like that. And then you got a outside fridge. Down here, front and rear, you got 12 volt uh, stabilizer jacks. So that's gonna be on the front and rear. Large 12 volt awning with an LED light strip that runs all the way along the bottom. And then there's outside speakers here. Solid steps to go up into the unit. Those store really, really nicely right up in the door there. And then a large grab handle. So we're gonna head inside here. Check this out. You got a king size bed in the master bedroom and pre-wiring for a second AC. But you got your storage all around. You got plugins on both sides, upgraded mattress that we put in there. And again, I said that's a king size. Sliding pocket door on both sides. So he's got this that comes off and bam, all the privacy in the world. Entertainment area here. So some storage, TV that comes with the unit. And then down here, you got your stereo. So that'll do inside and outside speakers, zone A, zone B. And then you got your uh, cluster here. So you can check all your tanks, water pump, um, water heater is gas and electric. So you got both those options your slide out switch and then your awning switch. Panning over to the living space, you've got a tri-folding sofa there. Tons of windows in the slide and then a dinette right back there. Over to the kitchen space, you got an island that comes out, peninsula there. All kinds of storage, residential sink, three burner cooktop with an oven. This is going to have your eight cubic foot gas electric fridge and freezer here. You keep on moving back. You do have an extra little pantry space or closet space, however you want to use this. It's very close to the bunk room. Go to the bathroom. So you do have a tub shower here. Pretty tall, lots of space, sink, and then you even got some counter space there in the bathroom with a plug-in, which is nice. Back to the bunk room here. So you've got 300 pound bunks. They've got plug-ins and USBs on both sides. And then you got storage space back here. So lots of shelves. Hookups for a TV and a mounting area for a TV. Now this other bunk flips up here. Otherwise you can put it down. The reason it flips up, you got a dinette right here that does make down to another bed, but it's just nice to have that extra seating space. Again, this is the 2020 Sunset Trail 289QB.